This is TJ. In this video, I want to quickly show you five websites that I like to use when I'm looking for free sound effects to use in projects that I'm doing. These websites are freesound.org, soundbible.com, sweetsoundeffects.com, soundj.com, and superflashbros.net slash as3sfxr. And all these websites have some pretty cool options for you for getting free sound effects to use in, let's say it's a video game, an animation, a movie you're making. Uh, and you can they have, the reason I like these is they have really good um, transparency on, on the licenses. So they're easy to understand. They're open licenses for the most part. Um, and I'll go through and download a sound clip from each one of these sites and then uh, and so you can get a feel for it, kind of how they work. This first one, freesound.org, I'm just going to search for flush, like a toilet flushing sound effect. Maybe I'm doing an animation that I want to use that in. So we have all these search results. Now not all of these I can use completely for free. I have to check out the licensing. So if, over here on the licenses, if I click this top thing, attribution, there's 190 results that, that are um, under the Creative Commons attribution license, which means I can use them. All I have to do is provide an attribution to the, uh, the original artist that created it and um, the name of the piece. So I would on this one I would do Manotrop and Flushing. Um, and I can click and listen to it right here. Okay, so that's a good sound effect. I can also toggle the view if I want to view, kind of see the quality of this audio file. It looks pretty nice. It's a it's a .wav file. Um, given the choice between WAV and MP3, I would always choose WAV. Um, it's a, a lossless audio format. Um, so yeah, I would just click here to download, and I can download and save it. Uh, right to my computer and then I'll have this to use. All I have to do is again provide attribution to Manotrop for his audio file titled Flushing um, and I could even say downloaded from freesound.org if I wanted to. But yeah the, the license um, information is over here. This work is is licensed under the attribution license with Creative Commons. So that's how you can know about that. Um, moving on this next one soundbible.com also kinda similar. I, I could just search through the sound effects they have but if I just um, type in flush here like I did at the last site it'll come up with a couple different options for me so these top two are licensed under public domain that means everyone has free access to them no one really claims them um, and these other ones are actually hiccup this is like a toilet flush it looks like and they are under the attribution license just like that last one we saw so I would need to provide attribution so I'll click on this top one from public domain though um, and take a look at it I can play oh yeah that's nice. So that's perfect, the sound I was looking for. And then I can uh, download the, looks like I can only download an MP3 if I use that one though. If I do this next one, it might have different options for me. Ooh. Oh, here's the wave over here, that's why I couldn't see it. So I can download the wave or an MP3. So I'll click on wave and I can just download it. And now I've got two different flushing sounds I can use and I can still provide attribution even though I don't have to it's public domain I can still say downloaded from soundbible.com that's always good to do just so people can if they want to find this sound they can find it and use it too okay this next one sweetsoundeffects.com again we can just search through um, the sound effects or I can just use the search bar I like to use the search bar because it gives me options um, on a lot of sites for doing advanced search options so I can search for sounds that are only Creative Commons or only public domain. Um, and this one it just happens to bring up a post for household sounds. And that's how it is with Sweet Sound Effects. You're going to download Sound Effects Packs. So this pack includes all these different sound effects. I can play and listen to each one of them here. Just one at a time. Okay, so it's going through and playing each of those sounds. So, but at the bottom looks like it has toilet flushing. So I would, to download this, I have to actually put in my email address here and then click download and the site will email me a download link. That's kind of the downside of this site, but then again, it is completely free and um, uh, the licensing we can read about, if we click on about frequently asked, que frequently asked questions, um, it'll talk about the licensing, like how you can use them, what you can use them for. Okay, and this next one, soundj.com. Um, it does not have a search bar and you have to be careful because it has these ads and a lot of these sites are going to have ads like on the sides of them, I don't know maybe these ones didn't but a lot of sites you go to are going to have ads and SoundJ definitely has ads so if you click on like household sounds is where that flush is going to be it's got ads over here, it's going to have oh I know, I'm using ad block right now so you don't see a lot of the ads um, but if I click on bathroom sounds 
see this ad um, it, people might click download now thinking they're downloading all these bathroom sound effects but it's really this sound effects pack something else you have to pay for um, so this bathroom faucet sink filling come on flushing here we go all right so it's a nice good flushing sound I can just click download this wave file and download it don't need to provide an email address or login or anything like that so now I have three different flushing sounds this one I will need to write, provide attribution to soundj.com and I can I know that because I can look in their terms of use and it tells me what I can use it for it says you can use this for commercial or non-commercial purposes but things I can't do is like claim it as my own sound or redistribute it somewhere like on the internet um, okay this last website is cool because what it does, I mean they're all cool, but this one is for generating your own sounds. So you see that, um, and it has some different random ones. Whoa. And then what you can do, you can modify these sounds. So if I go to this jump, and then I can change it. Oh, I missed it a little bit. I don't know a lot about these toggles. Anyway, when I find a sound that I want, then I can just click Export Wave, and I can just export that uh, as the wave file and use it. So this is more like a sound effects generator, and it's more for animations or games or things like that, but you could use it for whatever. But this random's pretty cool. Anyway, just a fun little site. Um, this is superflashbros.net. Um, so yeah, those are the sites I wanted to show you. Um, check out more of my, of my videos at my YouTube channel, TJ Free, or my website, tjfree.com. I do videos on um, royalty-free music, royalty-free pictures, and stock footage for videos, um, free eBooks, things like that, as well as tons of free and useful software. I just kind of show little snippets of them. So yeah, appreciate you watching this video, and uh, we will catch you on the next one. Take care.